Hi ladies, it's Muriel. I'm back with my third video. These are just a few uh, two, four, six, eight, nine flowers that I made on Sunday morning at my crop. So I'd gotten up at 7 o'clock. I came downstairs and um, just kind of cleaned up the desk and then went at it again. So um, I made these and then um, I left for about an hour. I went to um, ben Franklin, which is a arts and crafts store, and they have one here close, not close to me, but I hardly ever go to it. I only visit it if I have to go to the doctor's office because it's nearby, but this one was down the street from the crop, so I poked in there Friday, saw some things, and I thought I'll come back Sunday, so um, that's why I just made these amount of flowers because I was gone for about an hour and then I came back and by that time it was time to pack up and get out of there. So I basically just use some flower centers and some trims and the majority of the trims were uh, pieces. You remember Marissa had given me a bag full of stuff and I had gotten some stuff from Marla and I'd gotten some trims from um, someone else little bits and pieces so these were all made from those scraps so let's start here is some white a white uh, flower that I made and that center is from the forever 21 earrings and then this one here is beige this is a really pretty trim I don't know where I got this from it's probably Michael's a Hobby Lobby but it has these if you can see those edges aren't those pretty and the earring is from the antique mall I bought uh, one pair I found for five dollars a couple of weeks ago and I just uh, broke the back off of it and put it on there really really pretty and here's a pink one and it has a center that I made with four white pearls and some yellow uh, beaded trim and a pearl in the center a flat back I think it's a flat back pearl so I made a couple of those and I sent them to Marissa. So she has the a few of them that I made. So there's a pink one. And here's a piece of white trim again. And this flower, if you can see it, is from the Fact and Fiction collection of Basic Gray. Several of them came on here. So I used maybe a couple on the cards and then the rest I used for um, for these flowers here. So there's a big soft white one. Here is another white one with some um, trims that were just kind of loose, and that is a Forever 21 earring in the center. And there's one here with the basic gray flower in the center, and this is some white trim. All the trim that was loose was certainly less than a yard, so that's why I was able to just use it for purposes of making these flowers. And here is a small piece of beige lace, and this is just a flower rosette, a blue one. And then there is a center here that's from Recollections, that um, uh, flower center. And here is a beige one again with that funny, edgy um, edge to this trim. And that button is a vintage button from Marissa. Thank you very much. I love this little jar. She decorated it and it has some uh, buttons still left in there. And here's another small one with a um, center from the Recollection Collection, I believe. And then the last one is Totally Shabby Chic. It's definitely going to be used for Mother's Day. Um, that's why I made it wide enough and then there was some pink left over and then this beautiful um, uh, center that I believe is a bead that I picked up at Michael's. So that was my flowers that I made, ladies. Thank you so much. And now I am going to um, get this video downloaded and come back and show you some of the finds I purchased at Joann's, not Joann's, at Ben Franklin this weekend. Okay, thanks. Bye-bye.